What's good with y'all boys? You already know it's going dog. Come and get you another video. And look, before you start this video, keep the most high first. He's there for you when? On your bad times, your good times, your great times, your horrible times. So what's good with y'all boys? Make sure y'all hit that like button. You know, we're coming out with three drops today for you guys. I'm dropping this heat. We finna go crazy. So listen, you guys want to know how to make a woman chase you, pursue you forever. And listen, with this method, you know, not even with the method, I'm just say with this, with learning what makes a woman chase, it takes trial and error, guys. Sometimes it takes years of work. It takes years to understand, like, okay, if I do this, she's going to chase me. Or if I don't do this, she's not going to pursue me. You know what I'm saying? Or if I do this, she's going to give me a hard time. She's not going to care whether I leave or go. So learning from experience after experience, then you understand that, you know, this is going to make a chase. This is going to make her run away. You know what I'm saying? So you got to understand that, man. You got to understand that when you are trying to make a woman, you know, chase your validation forever. You have to understand that because it is possible. She remain attached because the thing is, the thing is with that is, once a woman understand that, you know, this is the guy I want, my mind is dumb. I'm gonna say this, you know, I'm gonna sum it up even better for y'all. Once a woman goes dumb, once she goes delusional over you, it's over with. It's over with, she's done. She's done. Once a woman is dumb for you, when I mean dumb, I mean dumb. Like she's just naive to you at this point. You know, she just wants you. Once a woman is like that, man, you got a hook for the entirety. You know what I'm saying? You got a hook for the majority, you know what I'm saying, of her prime years of her life. You got a hook because the imprint is going to be hard to rewrite. You are the strong imprint at that point. When you have a woman dumb, you have re-imprinted her. You have imprinted her to the point where she is like, damn, I can't get rid of this guy. You know, I can't. So, yeah, man, we're going to be hopping straight into it. Number one. Be a man of wisdom. A woman is intrigued. She is like a little kid at the playground when she meets a man with wisdom, a man who can teach her right from wrong, a man who can teach her that there is a God that made this earth, a man who can teach her, you know, how to manage her money, a man who can teach her things that she never even thought about. She's normally used to dealing with guys that just want to have sex and just chill netflix chill and that's it but she's never been with a guy who gets to talking deep about everything you know who gets to showing her that it's another spectrum of life and so with being a man of wisdom you become not only extremely attractive but you become a source of knowledge of hey you know what i'm saying she might say hey babe should i do this she's gonna ask you and put you this is what's so important about wisdom y'all She's going to include you in every situation that she goes through. You know, she's going to always ask you for advice. She's going to come to you with her deep and darkest secrets. You know what I'm saying? So being a man of wisdom, a woman will chase you because I'm telling you guys this right now. A lot of men out here do not have wisdom. They're just out here living. They're out here living just for the hell of it. And when a girl comes in contact with a man who can secure her livelihood who can lead her in the right direction man she's going to chase that forever because a man with wisdom can create not only you know a spiritual path to god but can also create you know wealth you know just overall just a better lifestyle man and sometimes women want that man a lot of time matter of fact all the time women wants that with sometimes you know all the time women you know what i'm saying women love that man being a man of wisdom having something within you you know they love that number two be ambitious not a man who's just working a nine to five all the damn time now don't get me wrong nine to fives nothing is wrong with nine to fives you work at nine to five until you can become that guy that you want to be but a man who is on his purpose a man who has actually discovered like hey i got a purpose i can do i got my own talent I could make my own money out of. I got my own plan that I can make my own money out of. You think a woman ain't gonna look at that and be like, damn, I, I just gotta, I gotta have. Cause when you are a man of purpose, a man that is on a mission, women love that. Women love a man who can create something out of nothing. You know, just take me for example, YouTube channel, you know what I'm saying? It's not big or nothing, but just think about this y'all. 
year after year after year after year i have been pursuing this dream of this youtube channel and it shows what in me it shows that not only that i'm determined but that i have passion and that i'm on a mission you know and that is all attractive to a woman man a woman will chase a man that does that because real women i'm telling you right now real women out here they know they know that you're going to be successful real women not the women who just want to wait at the finish line but the real women who actually in for the long haul they understand that hey this man is on a mission i can't play with him you know and i'm gonna tell y'all something just to go in deep in depth detail about that the women who usually wait you know what i'm saying for you to actually hop i'm gonna tell y'all right now they're not going to be that attractive but i'm gonna give you this gem that woman will do whatever you say so what does that mean it means that you can take her to the gym you can get on the right diet she'll do whatever the hell you say and she'll start to pick up and develop your habits so she'll go from maybe a five to eight just by hitting the gym and doing what you say you know getting diet right and everything but that's the gym with that man be mindful of the women who actually you know this not to go off too much of a subject but be mindful of the women who actually is there when you are building and growing you know be, be mindful of that because they do whatever the hell you say and you don't want to push some women off to the side just because they're not that attractive you know don't don't do that man i'm telling y'all this but yeah man when you are ambitious you can create lifestyles you can create opportunities and she understands that if she submits to you and she gets part of your program she's going to be that way as well you know she's going to get the opportunity you know everything as well and of course a woman is going to chase that dog number three you have to pull back slash walk away for a long period of time you have to do this a woman has to understand what it's like to be one month two months three months four months five months to a year without you if a woman doesn't understand that then she will never fully submit to you she will never fully give you cooperation she will always be a bitch around you you know what i'm saying if you show a woman what it's like to go three plus months without you she's gonna come crawling back dog she's gonna come crawling back even a year you know what i'm saying because when women understand that oh my goodness this guy has left me alone when you go three plus months three plus months and you don't look back you ignore everything she says you don't look back at all you just start improving yourself focusing on yourself she sees you coming up she will never give you a problem again but you have to do this, man. You're going to have to do this regardless. Unless you just already up. I see. I'm going to tell y'all something, guys. I wouldn't have to pull it back if I had, you know what I'm saying, 100K subscribers. And, um, you know, I just I just was out chilling. Because no girl is going to try to mess that up. She knows she messed that up. She gone. So, majority of the time, you have to do this in your building process, man. You have to do this in your building process. Because, you know, women think they can do better. They think they got a better option. But... When you up and you the best man you can be, she knows she can't do better. She already know it. You know what I'm saying? So, of course, she's not going to give you no problems. But, you know, for the time being, while you're in your building process, you have to pull back and walk away. A woman needs to know what it's like to be months without you. If you around this woman all the damn time, she's not going to ever get it. She's going to wake up and be like, oh, there his ass go. Oh, he come through the door. There his ass go. You know what? I'm tired of seeing his ass. He you know what he don't, he don't look all that good that's what she gonna start saying she gonna be looking at you through that through that door when you go through i'm tired of seeing your ass she gonna think that in her mind oh we need a break you know what i'm saying because they can't you know actively tell you what it really is so you have to give her the feeling of what it's like to not see your face to not be in your presence for a long time and i'm telling you right now once you do that she'll chase forever because she's not going to want to lose you. You know what I'm saying? Number four, you have to lay pipe strongly, passionately, effectively. If you do not lay pipe effectively, strongly, and passionately, she's going to leave you. I wouldn't want any girl that can't give me the pleasure that I need. And I would expect the same from a woman. A woman should never chase a man who can't even give her pleasure. And so should a man ever. Because the sex is a mutual transaction. If you can't lay pipe with a woman, you're done. I'm going to tell you this right now, you're done. You're done. If you can't lay pipe, you're done. 
because I'm telling y'all right now in this day and age, y'all, just keep it all the way a buck with you. In order for a woman to have some type of attachment to you, you got to get the pussy. You got to. You got to. Let's just keep it a buck. A woman ain't finna be attached to you from words, dog. What you gonna say? Oh, baby, be attached to me forever. From words? Without no pipe? Come on, dog. These women, they got a, a brain mechanism now to the point where you have to lay the pipe down so that you can get her under your submission. You have to. It's that simple. You know what I'm saying? And number five and final, you have to always show that you are that 1% man. And what do I mean by that? Constantly improving on your looks. Constantly working on your status. Constantly working on your business or whatever you got going. You know? Just always being that 1% man. And when you do that, she will understand that you are undeniably the best option. The more and more you do that, the greater and greater chance you have of making a chase you favor. It's that simple, y'all. It's that simple. These are the things that women chase. These are the things that make women chase. It's that simple, y'all. So if you didn't just video, make sure that like button. Also subscribe if you're new. Comment down below to know anything about this topic. And I'm out, y'all.